across junior forward Raquel Scott leads the Crusaders this season with 17.7 points per game and 9.4 rebounds per game. And the Ridgewood, New Jersey native has been on a roll. She tallied her 10th double-double of the season last week at Colgate, posted a team-high 24 points in a victory over Bucknell Saturday, and scored a team-best 16 points against Army on Wednesday. For her outstanding efforts on the court, she earns this week's Patriot League Rock and Refuel Performance of the Week. And she joins me now via Skype. Hey Raquel, how's it going up there in snowy Massachusetts? It's good. It's cold, but it's going well. So let's start with the Colgate game. You scored a career-high 31 points for the second straight game and pulled down a career-best 17 rebounds. Can you talk about your balanced attack in the paint? Um, well, the Colgate game, it's always an interesting matchup because Colgate always plays us tough. They have our number for some reason. Um, but coming into that game, I think that we all just went in with the mindset that we were going to do whatever it took to want to win that game. And I didn't even realize how many rebounds I had until after. But, I mean, looking back on that game, I think that our guards were great. They got us the ball inside. And the second chance putbacks that we had, I mean, really contributed to a big win. And when I had the opportunity scoring from the perimeter also um, presented itself that game. So I think just all around... Um, a diverse performance on offense really helped us pull through a win in that game. You recorded your 1,000th career point last week against the Raiders, becoming the 31st women's basketball player in Holy Cross history to do so. What was that like, and how has that accomplishment inspired your game going forward? It was actually interesting because during the Colgate game, I didn't know how many points I had because they don't have a personal like scoreboard. So I had no clue until I stepped out during one of the media timeouts and my teammates were like, congrats. I was like, for what? They're like, you scored your thousand points. So I mean, it definitely didn't really affect my play that game because I wasn't aware of it. But going forward, I mean, just a huge accomplishment and the support that I've gotten from my coaches, my friends, my teammates, it really just helps your confidence. And a huge part of the game is just being confident in your ability to score and win. So. I mean, that accomplishment, incomparable, and I mean, it just really, it's a huge highlight of my career so far. So, we know that you played volleyball in high school and your sister played at Penn State. Is there anything you learned from that sport that you bring to the basketball court? Uh, definitely agility. Um, the endurance in basketball is something that's definitely not there in volleyball, but quick movement side to side and also just like jumping. I mean, being able to just harness your athleticism in volleyball also really helps in basketball and on the court as well. The Patriot League season started a bit slow for your team, but you've now won five of your last seven games. What's been the difference over the last three weeks? Um, I think just team building is huge for us. In the beginning of the season, we were a very new team. We lost a couple of uh, vital players and seniors, and we gained a lot of new talent in the freshmen. I mean, we have five freshmen, but incorporating everyone and everyone just being comfortable in their roles and just doing their roles to their best ability, I think that has really helped us build as a team. And the chemistry that we've built off the court has definitely transferred on the court. And I mean, it shows in our performance in the last seven games, like you said. Okay, Raquel, well, thanks so much for your time and best of luck the rest of the season. Thank you.